I'm back with another video. Today I want to share with you my October favorites and what I'm currently using up and yeah, so let's get started. So I'm going to show you the Hygienic products first. So right here we have the Studio Selections Moisture Luxury Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, I am about halfway through on this and this one is a little more than, um, well, a little less than halfway full. So I have the next two weeks to use this up. So I'm almost done with this. And this is gonna be in next month's empty. So this takes me two months. This takes me three. Um, I love the studio selections of the Tresemme and I love the Tresemme brand um, but since you know I was going to Dollar General so often for my hygiene products this was what I was limited to at the time and it was most affordable so this was like four dollars each um, so they only had two brands they had this one and then they had the uh, smooth and silky so I love this it smells really good and it works really well for my hair next I'm using the Dove Notion Secrets Restoring Ritual Coconut Oil and Almond Milk Body Wash I love Dove <laughs> I do um, I've been using it for the past six months um i love it i completely switched over my body wash and deodorant um and bar soap to dove um and i've had no breakouts and rashes since then um except the deep moisture I just I can't use that one but I love Dove and I love this body wash this this one has a warm almond milk and a hint of coconut oil I get mostly almond milk with this and it smells really good that's why I I'm using this for the fall because of that almond note and it's so good. If I can get this in the, the deodorant or the bar soap, I will. Most, I, I would definitely get it if I could find it, but it's very good. I love it. And yeah, I know that's gonna be gone in the next two weeks, it's gonna be gone. Next is the Dove White Bar. So this one is the one that is currently in my shower right now. I started it um, a, about a week ago. I I love it. It's my favorite um, Dove soap next to the rejuvenated pear and aloe. I like that one too. That one is really good, but. I like this one as well so um, this would definitely be a repurchase for me and it really saved my skin and my irritation um, from that Dove soap I well the Dove body wash it really saved my skin and I can't get enough of it I will always repurchase this and last is the Cetaphil Gentle Skin Cleanser. Now, I was online making my small list of what I need to purchase as far as like the essential hygienic items. And I could not remember if it was the if it was this one or for the sensitive skin. Um, I don't know which one I purchased, but I like this one. This one is about halfway through, so I might get through it by the end, end of this month, 
um, but I love it and it works really well for my skin. I case my, my face nice and moisturized and then I go in with the face cream or the face lotion and um, I just love it. So thank you so much for your suggestions on Cetaphil because it works, it works great for me and my sister skin. So um, I recently, again, got bit on my eyelid so I can't use the Benadryl cream so I've been using the face wash twice a day um, in the morning and at night to um, heal the um, the bite on my eyelid. <laughs> so the Benadryl cream, I use this almost every single day and I'm about like a quarter left on this so this will probably be gone by the end of the month and I think I have one or two I think I might have one more of the uh, original strength left so I I'm just trying to get through this one I've had this since probably December <laughs> so, um, I just use just a very little bit a little bit goes a long way for me but um, yeah, this is the one that I'm just currently trying to use up. We have a really bad mosquito problem on the back porch, so they like to hang out by the back door. Um, and every time I open the door, one always seems to fly in, and it always seems to bite me. Nobody else in the house gets bit except me. So, um, and then for Bath and Body Works, um, body care, well, first I'm currently using the Fancy Love by Jessica Simpson. I love this one. This is my favorite body mist from her line that I've tried, and I will repurchase another one eventually. Um, I have a list of celebrity fragrances that I would like to purchase um, later. Um, but this one has a slight scent of like a sweet floor and then I get all alcohol scent from this so this used to smell really good but I think it's it's gone bad this is from 2016 so what would he it's already gonna be 2022 so I need to just use it up and yeah right now i'm like about halfway through so this is the one that i'm just currently trying to focus on um just using right now and then i have the lavender and sandalwood body mist with the cream so i use this at night this just a nighttime scent for me i I'm currently like a quarter through and then the body cream is probably down to here <laughs> maybe um, so I love this this is my favorite floor scent I rave about lavender all the time I can't get enough of it and this will probably be done by the end of this month I got we got two more weeks left so this one I'm just this one stays by my on my nightstand and yeah I use it every single night and I love it and then I have the bourbon strawberry and vanilla that I've been working on as well and I just started the body cream because I just finished one I think one little lotion that the travel size that I have over there so I'm trying to get through my travel size little lotions there because they take up a lot of space. Um, so, just started this, but I've been working on this every so often throughout the day, and I love, I love this fragrance. And I think I have one more. Yeah, I have one more that's repackaged on my shelf. So, um, yeah, but. I 
had so many of these. I think I had like four or five of these at one point. And yeah, now I'm down to two. <laughs> so yeah, it's my favorite fragrance. And if they do come out with it during the semi-annual, I will buy one or two more of these just to have. Um, but yeah, I love this one. And yeah, it's my favorite strawberry scent. And then I recently started the Bright Autumn Blooms. So I want to try to get through this collection. Um, this one is the collection that I'm just trying to use out as far as fall um, goes. And I don't have any body creams to go with this. So I thought I would just use up the entire collection. I think I used up the body creams to it, but I love it, and it's a very sweet but musky and warm floral. Um, this could definitely pass out as like a spring scent, but because of that warm note, um, I'm just using it up. So I just recently started this, and I love it, and my boyfriend loves it on me. So. <laughs> It's a great fragrance. And then Whipped Vanilla and Spice. And this one I think I started last month. And I use it every once in a while, but it's not my main focus right now. So um, like the bourbon strawberry and the uh, lavender and sandalwood. But I did start this and I, I like it. It's a warm, vanilla note with a hint of spice. I like this one. My boyfriend does not. So I sprayed myself before he came over and he was like, you need to go take a shower because I can't, whatever you're wearing, I just, I don't like that scent. So, I don't know. He doesn't like vanilla fragrances. I do. But he likes lavender. He likes lavender scents. He just doesn't like vanilla fragrances so I'll just use this when he's not around but I like it I love this fragrance and yeah so that's it for what I'm currently using and what I've been loving lately and um, yeah so I actually want to do a cleaning vlog tonight I do my room is a hot mess right now and it needs to be dusted but it needs cleaning so I might be uploading a video um, tonight as well I'm gonna probably do that next it's not so bad but I've been having fits of sneezing and a stuffy nose um, for the past week so it needs cleaning and I'll probably wipe down my fan too I'm gonna to turn it off and I'll probably wipe that down along with um, just dusting so um, yeah but that's it for this video and I'll see you guys in the next one